The first pizzeria up is John's Pizzeria. It's on Bleecker in Greenwich Village. It's actually called John's of Bleecker. And this is our first time here. They're known for their coal fire pizza. Something that's completely illegal now. You couldn't open up a pizza place and do coal fire ovens. Nah, they won't let you. This place still has them though. This is gonna be a very traditional New York style pizza. They've been around since 1929. And we got a large John's original today. So that's just mozzarella, tomato sauce on a beautiful coal fire pizza. Now they're one of the only spots where you can get a true coal fire pizza in New York City because those kinds of ovens are kind of outlawed right now, but they were grandfathered in since they are a classic New York City institution. We recently did a tavern style pizza tour of Chicago, but look at that beautiful slice. The bottom looks coldly cold, cold and super saucy. Let's go, baby. First of all, there was no wait because it is a weeknight and it's kind of late, so we got seated right away. They put us in this really cool booth toward the front, so we have a window to Greenwich Village. Really, really amazing. And we weren't 100% sure what we should order, but we figured, hey, this is our first time at John's. Let's just go with the classic John's original, which is what this pie is. Mm. Oh, wow. This is beyond legit. This is 401k legit. Every bite of this pizza brings a cheese pull. That's super epic. I don't want to overstate it, nor do I want to oversimplify it, but this is a really perfectly done pizza. When you go to an institution like John's Oblique, there's always that worry. Is it overhyped? Is it, have they lost a step? I can tell you with confidence, this pizza is extraordinary. Mmm, throw some red pepper flakes on this slice and go for another one. Actually, I had one off camera because I didn't want the pressure of the bright lights. Just kidding, I just was so hungry. So here we go, another slice. Mm. One of our one of our newfound perks of living in New York City is that we could come on a weeknight when it's not super busy. We don't have to wait a half an hour to get the pizza. Uh, it's great because you know coming on a Friday or Saturday we'd be eh, it wouldn't make for a good production We'd be so hungry by the time the pie came, but now we can just chill make some great content Some of the best content on all of YouTube, but honestly and, and by the way this pie is obviously vegetarian friendly We didn't get any meat tonight. We just wanted to keep it basic I can see us coming back to John's over and over again now. We're not gonna film every time. I'm sorry to say but We'll make our way down the menu and just try everything they have to offer. I, I, I typically don't eat the crust unless there's a dipping sauce associated with it. I'm going to rate this pizza four Babe Ruths and two big puns. Well, that was a magnificent pie and you can see the proof right here. We ate every single last slice and most of the crust.